This is a guide to flying my Republic P-47 Thunderbolt, recreated at double scale in stock Kerbal Space Program. For the most part, the P-47 behaves like standard aircraft with typical control inputs. The exception comes with the engine, which is a stock electric propeller propelled by reaction wheels. To start the engine, stage and begin trimming roll with Alt and Q. This will start the takeoff roll. When the propeller is trimmed fully to the left, switch back to the main craft. As you accelerate down the runway, the tail wheel will lift up. Hold it in this position as you gain speed, but make sure not to pitch too far forward or the propeller will strike the runway. The flaps will hold the speed down just below the takeoff speed, so release them using the zero key when you are ready to take off. Looking at the aerodynamic overlays makes this clearer. Cruise mode has all lift vectors pointing forward for maximum rotational speed, but also maximum propeller separation. Takeoff mode, sewn here, reduces both thrust and propeller separation. Another detail with the engine is the functional cowl flaps, which are actuated using the three action group. These have no effect on performance, but they're a fun detail. Similarly, you can see the functional gun on the wing here. We'll make use of that later. The Thunderbolt is surprisingly agile for its size, if you know how to treat it. Here I am performing a modified wing over maneuver. Pitch up to gain altitude and decrease speed, then roll to one side while yawing to bring the plane around quickly. This allows the pitch to contribute to the yaw motion. As it is approaching 180 degrees yaw, begin to level the wings out and pitch up to hold altitude. Here, we can make use of the guns, which are fired using the staging sequence. The first round is the only one which actually fires, whereas the second one is a longer decorative burst for screenshots and similar fun. Altitude and speed can easily be traded back and forth through the use of dives and climbs. By doing this, you can easily exceed the 50 meters per second top speed in level flight, reaching speeds of 60 or even 70 meters per second. For landing approach, I repeat the yaw maneuver without pitching at first to lose altitude quickly. Here a couple of things will happen quickly. The gear is lowered, as are the flaps. Additionally, the propeller is trimmed to takeoff mode for approach, and later the trim is cancelled using Alt plus X. This lets the propeller pinwheel without providing thrust, meaning that the aircraft will lose speed and altitude quickly. On landing, touch down level on the main gear before braking to bring the tail wheel down. Wheel brakes are more than enough to bring it to a halt.
And with that, you know everything you need to know to how to fly the P-47. You'll find the download link in the description below. Enjoy it, and happy flying.